Hi there guys, welcome back to the Farrington channel and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to mine sugar. Okay guys, so I'm sure you saw in the thumbnail but the reason that I'm showing you guys how to mine sugar at the moment is as you can see on the mining pool stats and provided from mining, mining stats is that if you have one kilo hash at the moment it's going to be paying out six dollars and 82 in usd fiat value as you can see there's not much trading volume going on either on uh, extributron or any of the other market places that are on there at the moment so do take this with a grain of salt but what i am going to be doing is because it's cpu mining i'm going to go ahead and do a 24 hour uh, results video for you guys and i'll show you guys how to mine it and then tomorrow i'll show you my 24 hour mining results to see whether it was profitable uh, or whether it showed to any of the stats you know, as provided to here, which I don't believe it will do, but if it does, I'll be very, very shocked. Okay, so the first thing that you're gonna need before you start mining sugar is you're gonna need to go ahead and grab yourself their wallet. So on the website, all you need to do is just go ahead and press Control F and type your wallet as I've already done there. Take yourself down to the Windows 64-bit edition, go ahead and click on there, scroll down and press on the Windows 64 zip and go ahead and click on that. Now, once that's downloaded, find yourself to your download location. Okay, so now you downloaded the wallet, let's go ahead and open up the zip file. Let's go ahead and drag and drop this out. And for myself, it is gonna say replace the files, but I'm gonna go ahead and close this off. Now, once you've done that, if you go ahead and open up the folder that you downloaded, if you take yourself to the bin folder and then go ahead and double click on the sugar chain QT, and then what you'll be greeted with is their wallet. Now what we're going to need to do to actually start mining is we're going to need to go ahead and set ourselves up an actual wallet address. So because I plan on to mine to our plant, I'm going to go ahead and type in our plant so I know exactly where I'm receiving it from. Press request payment, this is quite important. Go ahead and copy the address and from there we will go ahead and now start setting up the how to set the miner up. Okay, so now we've got our wallet address, let's go ahead and take ourselves over to a pool of our own choice and what i'm going to do is go ahead and press on connect now to get this started we're going to need to get ourselves a miner so as you can see here our plant has already provided a link for us to go ahead and download this from but i will throw it into the description for you guys just to make it a little bit easier so what we're going to, need to do is if you're on windows just go ahead and press on the windows zip then once that's downloaded you might have to press ctrl j and just keep the dangerous file from there okay Okay, so bringing ourselves back over to our desktop and our download location, what we're gonna need to do is we're gonna need to actually extract all these files into a folder. So go ahead and right click and create yourself a new folder on your desktop. Call this folder whatever you'd like. And then what we're gonna need to do is just go ahead and highlight everything and then drag and drop it straight into the folder. So now that that's gone ahead and put itself in the folder, let's open it up. And as we can see here, there's already a miner set there for sugar. So as you can see, it's already got the EU R plant ready and set up in there for us. So all we're gonna need to do is go ahead and copy the address. And then we're gonna need to do is change this. And then because I'm gonna be using a Ryzen 7, I'll pop that as the name. Once named, all we're gonna to need to do is go ahead and then save this. And then if we go ahead and close this off and then we double click on the sugar, we should now be successfully mining to sugar chain. So let's just give this a moment to set itself up. What I'm gonna do as well is just go ahead again and copy the address. So as you can see, it's starting up and we're starting to actually get some accepted shares, which is good news. Does this show us uh, the hash rate? But what we'll do is let's just jump over back over to the R plant and let's go ahead and throw our wallet address in there so we can actually go ahead and track how much that we can be earning from this. So if we pop this in here, and as you can see there, uh, the Ryzen 7 has just started up and it's 
just starting to show its hash rate there. So what I'm going to do is I will be leaving this for 24 hours. I'm going to do a test just to see um, you know, exactly how much I'll be able to earn from this. As I say, I have said before in previous videos that the minor stats calculator is, is, is massively incorrect. Uh, and sometimes there are some errors and it doesn't show up right. Um, but if, if that is uh, not the case in this situation, then you guys will find out in 24 hours. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys are going to start mining no sugar yourself, if you already have started mining sugar yourself. And make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.